so one of the questions we get asked at Dorks quite a lot is the best way to try out different mouthpieces. Um, so today I'm going to give you our top five tips for trying out clarinet mouthpieces. So number one um, is always try it out on your own instrument. Um, you're presumably going to be playing your new mouthpiece on your own instrument. So always remember to take your instrument with you, try it out on an instrument you know. Number two um, is compare it with your existing mouthpiece um, so you can make sure kind of you're definitely getting an improvement um, and it's not just that it sounds different in the room you're trying it out in or anything. Next up is make sure you've got an appropriate read um, for the mouthpiece you're trying. If you're unsure about this, um, always ask the staff here at Dorks. They're really knowledgeable about reeds and mouthpieces and will make sure you're playing something appropriate. Um, so some mouthpieces um, are more resistant than others, some are less resistant. So you might find you need a slightly different reed strength um, to what you've been playing on before um, to get kind of the same feel of the mouthpiece. So that's a really important thing. Make sure you've got a reed that's suitable for the mouthpiece you're trying. Next up um, on the actual trying, um, you're probably going to want to test the tuning of it. Mouthpieces can affect the tuning of your instrument and it's always worth listening carefully to the tuning, either for example across scales or across octaves, kind of and if you can, you should do that with a digital tuner on the stand and that will just show you exactly where you are. Um, again, if you need any help with that, you can always ask a member of the staff um, to lend you a pair of ears to have a listen and see which mouthpiece your tuning sounds best on. As well, when you're kind of testing, you want to try all the different ranges of the instrument with the mouthpiece. Um, so make sure the mouthpiece is responding nicely at the bottom all the way up to the top. Um, so it should feel kind of very even across the whole range. Um, the final thing I'd say is it's really good if you can try a mouthpiece at home, kind of in a room you're familiar with, as well as trying it obviously in the testing rooms here at Dorks. Um, you could take them home and try them. And from Dorks, you can take up to three mouthpieces away with you. So you can, for example, choose your favorite three, take them home for 14 days um, and decide which your favorite one is, which is the one you want to keep. And you can even do that with mail order as well. Um, so hopefully those tips are helpful and good luck choosing your new mouthpiece.